Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art and let's draw my version of a Cuphead skin in Fortnite. So let's get started with a quick sketch and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this and the beginning I draw the overall head shape first, so which is gonna be a cup. So we're just gonna draw one straight line across. And then we're gonna draw a really big bow shape. This is probably the trickiest part. Okay, and then from here, um, right in a little bit below the middle, he's just gonna draw his nose. All right, and then from here, um, I'm gonna draw two lines. So I'm gonna make his eye look very mean. Okay, draw two lines down, and then we're gonna come out on his side side of the nose and this is just gonna be the eye so we're gonna curve it straight out okay and then from here just draw in this is actually his eyeball so we're gonna come up and just kind of pinch it in let's draw a shape like that i know it's a little bit different from the cuphead but i just kind of want to make it look mean and let me shade this in real quick You guys haven't played it cuphead's a really cool game and you can see a lot of drawings that i've done on cuphead love the game and the retro look is just that it's a little bit too hard i can't pass the game so i'm kind of stuck unless you keep playing it then if you play a lot i guess you can pass it but yeah it's pretty hard it's a cool looking game okay so that's going to be his eyes, nice and uh, mean. And then for his teeth, uh, it's going to be grinning. So I'm just going to draw, you can draw a curve like this. And just curve it back down. And then now for his teeth, it's just going to be center line. And then we're just going to go all the way around. All right, and then from here, uh, we can draw in, we're drawing the straw. So this one's easy, we just go straight up. And just kind of close it off with a slant and it's gonna be bent. So from here, just kind of go out and then close it off. And we'll give a couple of stripes here. And we gotta draw the handle. Um, let's say it's on the rear somewhere so we can't see the whole thing. So I'm just gonna draw a little bit on the, on the side. All right, so let's move down to the to the body. So here we're gonna draw his scarf. So we can just come down two lines, and then we're gonna meet up in the center somewhere. And then now for the inside of the scarf. So this is over his neck, and we can add in just a few lines just to show that it's cloth. Okay, and then from here let's draw in this whole body shape and gonna come out and then we're gonna pinch it in to the waist and then we gotta close it off and let's give them the two belts again so we're gonna come down one section and then one more smaller section and then the details the buckle and then the two straps I mean the the loops, one more buckle, draw a little two lines like that, and then we're gonna add two more loops. All right, so now let's see, let's draw in, well, let's finish up the middle then. I'm gonna give him the uh, the bombs on this strap to his, his waist, his body. So that's gonna be one, we're gonna draw another one, and then now we're gonna draw in the strap, so it's just gonna come right across. This one's gonna go back up. Okay, and then let's see some details. And this is actually his teeth, so I'm just gonna draw a curve and then just a line like that. And we can add in the little wings on the bomb. Okay, just a little bit of detail. I can't go too small. And okay, let's finish it off and let's give him the, 
straps on the side. So one, two. All right, so that's his body. Let's finish up his arm. So we're gonna come out. Armpit. Biceps, there's the elbow. And then we're gonna come out a little bit and then we're just gonna close it. So we're gonna give, give him these uh, big fluffy gloves. Well, just, uh, just on the arm part, not the hand part. Okay, so we're gonna come down. That's his wrist and we're gonna give him his fist. That's his thumb. Back of the hand and the fingers folded in. All right, so that's one arm and let's move on to the other one. And the other one is gonna have a weapon because he shoots from his fingers. Shoulder, armpit, and then the bicep. And then I'm just gonna close it off because this is the weapon I'm giving him. So it's gonna be his whole arm. Okay, so just make a big triangle, uh, rectangle like this. And then we we'll come down with a bigger rectangle, another rectangle almost a square and then now to dry his hand so it comes straight out his thumb curving in palm now we're gonna draw two fingers one and two and then we'll just connect that this is his palm and then for his fingers this is gonna be part of his gun so I'm gonna just one big one just draw one big one like that first and then we just cut it in half Okay, so that's gonna be part of the gun. Or the blaster, I guess, <laughs> whatever it is. And then from here, uh, so we come here, draw a little line and we're gonna make a rectangle. Kind of surrounding his fingers and then we can give, let's add a little bit more detail. We'll just give a slightly bigger rectangle. And then we're just gonna come out straight. We're gonna keep it simple. It's just gonna be one big barrel. So just flare it out a little bit. Let's close that off. And then let's add in a tube just to make it a little bit more interesting. So just curb, curb. And now just draw in some lines. Some kind of hose. Okay, and then maybe, maybe you can even add in, let's add in a little circle there just for some more detail. All right, so that's his uh, finger blaster, I guess. So, so let's move on to uh, his leg. So he's gonna be wearing shorts. So let's come down the middle. Draw a little uh, line there, and then we'll come out. And he can flare out a little bit, because since they are just shorts, close that off. So again, let's come down, flare it out a little bit. Close it off. And then now, just come down, this is his leg, just close that off. And then we're gonna draw a square almost. That's his knee. And then on the inside, we'll draw a little rectangle and just kind of connect these the corners. Okay, so that's the, the knee pad. So we're gonna come, let's work on the other leg. So it's gonna be the same thing. Square. Rectangle inside and connect those corners. And then his lower leg's gonna be pretty much the same thing. We're gonna flare it out, pinch it in, close it. Just draw two lines and then we're gonna give him the fluffy, just give it a bracket, close it. And then big dome shape, close that. Just a little bit so. All right, so nice and big. So flare it out, pinch it in, close it. Two lines and then two brackets. Close that. And the dome shape. Oh, I'm not going too fast, I know. Cause it's the same thing as the other leg. All right, so that's pretty much his body. So now let's draw his weapon and I'm giving him a, a straw. So from here, just slant up. Okay, and then we're gonna give these kind of shapes cause it's, you know, it's got the bending part of the straw. So just kind of 
angle angle all the way around it and then we're just gonna close it off okay and then in here just give it same kind of little angle but a little bit sharper because it's being bent in all right and then this now you can just add in some lines and it doesn't necessarily have to match up just as long as you have some lines makes it look like a straw okay and then for the sharp part uh, we're gonna come out so we're gonna make this straw kind of torn and ripped up nice and sharp okay so that's one and we're just gonna connect that and then we're gonna add one more behind it so just a bunch of spikes basically all right and then just finish off the straw so we're gonna continue this line all the way down and continue this line all the way down as best as you can and then we're going to close it off then finally let's add in some sections because this straw usually have different colors and that is it for my cuphead skin in fortnite hope you guys like the way it turned out and if you do please do give me a thumbs up and i will see you next time